Jagas recommends that maiden heifers are bred with dairy AI because they are the most fertile animals in the herd and they have the highest EBI. So make sure to target your heifers with sexed or conventional dairy AI to maximize the rate of genetic gain in your herd. By using dairy sires for at least one round of inseminations, the number of beef stock bulls needed to breed the repeating heifers can be reduced, typically by two thirds for each round of AI used. Breeding heifers is challenging because they are often on an outblock or far away from the farmyard. So use synchronization to maximize the submission rate and to re reduce the labor required. Your main options for synchronization include a single prostaglandin injection to heifers not inseminated after the first week of AI, or else an eight day progesterone protocol that facilitates timed AI of all heifers on a single day. My name is Laura Hannon. I'm farming with my dad, David, and my mom, Catherine, at Dairy Patrick Drum, Marie County Meads. I'm standing here on our out farm where we rear 80 replacement heifers. Our plan is to AI the heifers here starting the last week of April to get the best genetics out of them. Because we're on an out block, we plan on synchronising the heifers to make heat detection easier. Our plan is to start AI on a Monday. We'll AI for the week and then on the following Monday, anything that hasn't been AI'd, we'll inject with prostaglandin and AI them after that. Last year, the synchronisation programme that we used allowed us to get a great number of heifers from our heifers. Rearing heifers on an outblock shouldn't put you off using at least one round of AI because you could be losing out on some of the best genetics of your herd.